Tomorrow, the topic is mental health, and it's something that we all need to be focusing on to get through these next few weeks. News 5's Caroline Sweeney talked to one expert about how to approach this challenging time. This is how Sunday in Cleveland looks now. Empty streets, uninhabited parks, very few people outside. This is a marathon. This is not a sprint. We were supposed to get the green light to resume our normal lives on Monday, but Governor Mike DeWine now says stop. The order stays in place until May 1st. Scott Schlachter says forget the big countdown. Take one day at a time. Well, I think that people, um, first of all, should just think about the next several days. That's how we're going to combat this um, and not look too far ahead because it becomes daunting. Schlachter says go outside if you can, staying six feet apart because... It's like taking free antidepressant medication. When you are inside, he says practice good habits. I think people are really bored. They don't, they've run out of ideas and they will then start to, to drink. Alcohol is a depressant. Schlachter warns it could increase anxiety. Both he and DeWine stress getting help through telemedicine. Uh, mental health is truly just as important as physical health. I think it's very helpful. It's not the perfect thing, but it's more than enough to be able for the clinician to see what's going on and help the client deal with what they're struggling with. For now, Schlachter says keep a schedule every day, even if you don't leave the house. In Cleveland, Caroline Sweeney, News 5.